holding this less. Now, I didn't know what you're holding now. Isn't that actually two, two sections of the gun? Yes, actually, uh, actually, you're correct. It is. First of all, we have. Dude, show you how show uh, the Iron Maiden. We're gonna we're gonna disassemble the Iron Maiden and uh, show you how it's done. Just field strip it so we can clean it and uh, get her back going again. If uh, got clogged up with mud or such, so we'll start by popping the old trigger group out here. And first, I'm gonna cock it. And freaking ugh, brand new. There's a the trigger group. Set her to the side. And there's a the stop. Sit it down here so it's not in the way. Remember now that the table's just balanced there. Oh yeah. <laughs> if you flip it off on the floor, we will all. <laughs> <laughs> Laugh our asses off at you. <laughs> oh man. Alright. So now what we're gonna do is flip the old dude around this way. <laughs> Zoom it in, damn it. <laughs> <clears throat> oh man. Let's see here. First I just started back. Oh, okay, okay. That's just so it's easier to edit and all that. Oh, okay. All right. Put the, this little dude in a vise to make it a little easier. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> That's all I could do in that original video was remote. I was too damn sorry to get my ass up in front of the camera. I figured what the hell we'd throw in some nostalgia over here. So now we're going to pull the spring back. Recoil spring. And there she is there. And now we can do away with this for a moment. Just easier so it don't go flying across the table. Rotate over on their side. The off rod. I have found since this thing is so not broke in yet. Take a little screwdriver and go pop. And there's the off rod. And then slide the bolt out. Turn it. There you go. There's the bolt. And now I need. Oh yeah. And we're going to, have to pause camera because you've got to get your GI tool to disassemble the gas system. Yeah. But you got your tools out of the uh, trap door in the butt, correct? Correct. Should have thought of that. Leave that open. Do that so it won't fall out. All right. So tell the audience where you got your <clears throat> the tool, the chamber brush, the grease. Pulled it out of the. Uh... It's stuck in the rod section of the handle. That's all. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Pulled it out of the uh, butt stock of the. Uh weapon. Now, take the old tool here and... Now if you need that side like ranch, you more... Open. Yeah, I was going to say, I didn't, I didn't put it too tight. Okay. Take the uh, gas plug loose. Unscrew the girl here. Fine threads. There we go. There's the gas plug, and there's the 
pierce the piston. And then you take the scope off, which I'm not going to do because it's a pain in the butt. Then you can slide the shield off here and also take the front side off, take the muzzle brake off, and then all this will also come loose and out the way. All right, go ahead. And it will come loose and out of the way. And you may have to tap it a little. There, there you go. Goes. And then this all comes loose, but you have to take the side off and all that stuff, and it's just a pain in the butt. So we're not going to do that for this video. But once the or the the scope comes off, the guard comes, the uh, heat shield comes off. Heat shield. Yep. Yeah. And uh, then the barrel comes off, the sight comes off, and uh, all that good stuff. You need to go down that far to clean it the rest of the way. But uh, this will this will get you far enough where you can get to the the uh, gas holes in the bottom of the barrel and uh, clean the ga uh, gas chamber and all that good jazz. All right, put it back together. And then. Reassembly. Okay. Actually, I can do that. And then there's a little flat edge piston here. It goes in the top of the gas tube. Slide right through. Actually hit it the first time. That Easy. A, that's a first. There you go. <laughs> Move the lug down. Put the gas cap back on. And just give her a little snug for now. How is the buck tail to really hold the rifle to tighten that plug really tight? I'll I'll get to that here toward the end. Okay. Once I, once cool. I get it all back together here. Slide the piston back forward. Ready. Put the uh, reinstall the bolt. There's a tang here for the fire pin, firing pin. Slide into the bridge. You gotta get it lined up just right, and I actually got it right the first time. Slid right in, all the way to the rear. Take your up rod and rotate it correctly. Slides into place, and now it's not in a track yet. Sight vice? Mm, no. About 21 years. <laughs> well, that's not too bad looking for 20 years, 21 years. Yeah. It's got some hellacious polymer to it, I'll tell you. I don't know what they made it out of, but it's held up really well. Back up. And 
here's where I got the uh, tools from. I'll go ahead and reinsert those now. You'll need that one. I will, I will need those, that, that in a minute. You're right. Yep. I'll wait on that then. I did say I was going to do that, didn't I? All right. This little notch slides back in, falls into place. Make it a wee bit easier. Flip it over again. Line the trigger group up. trigger back into place, put the safe on, which means that the hammer is cocked, and now, operate everything, and we didn't take the trigger group apart, but there's definitely not any grease on it, you can, yeah. you can tell it's hanging right there. It's alright, we'll grease it after we get finished, just wanted to do a demo of how you take it apart and put it back together. So that works like it's supposed to. There. It's all right, we'll grease it after we get finished. Just wanted to do a demo of how you take it apart and put it back together. So that works like it's supposed to. Now Finish tightening up. Go ahead. And so, come down here like this. Well, nope, that's going to be in the way. I'm going to put the rifle between my feet and then take the uh, tool here, finish snugging her down. <laughs> so, and here we are reassembled. Anything else? I guess that's it.